All right, let's start then. We're, are we going? You got your camera rolling? All right. A uh, couple good subjects tonight. But first, let's, let's do a roll call with who's here. All right, Old River's in. Yeah. Did gold, gold shoes. He's not here, but he's he, surprising. I told him about the meeting, but he's in. Marty's Monsters. Yeah. Silver Shoes. Yep. Green Baron. So I talked with Bob two hours ago. Uh, he's in, can't make it tonight, but he's in. Uh, Bud Shooters. We're here. Moby Dick's crew, I talked with Terry about uh, an hour ago. He's in, but can't be at here tonight, neither can Jim. Pete Peters, I talked with, with uh, Pete last week. Uh, even despite the loss of Chris, they are in. Interstate Batteries is in. Two baggers, same thing. Mike couldn't make it tonight, but they are in. Did you see the gold that you're in? What's that? Did you see the gold that you're in? They're in. Uh, two baggers are in. The Stingers. Here. All right. Iron Man. Not here. I haven't heard from them either. The Ringers, Tom. You're here? You're right half here. <laughs> uh, Clydesdales. I don't think the Iron Man played last year. Iron Man? I thought they were done completely. Yeah, they You know, you might be right. Yeah, they were right. Remember they said they're not playing. Yeah, you might be right. I think I kind of remember that too. Well, I'll, I'll still give uh, uh, Frank a call and see what he said. Uh, Ringmasters. I haven't heard either way. Key baggers. Yep. Uh, are you here? Yeah. Uh -huh. What's going on with Hitman? Most of the team. Hitman's in. They're coming back. Sand snipers? No. That's a question mark. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Any new teams? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We have ten. Ten teams present. But on my uh, humble opinion, that qualifies as a quorum. I just got a text. No, I didn't. All right. Uh, any any of the rules we want to change, other than talking about handicap right now? Is there anything from prior year that you can think of? And remember, last year was was a fubar year. Right. I'm, I'm basing the standings this year, when I get old everybody, on the 2018 final, or 2019 finals. Well, last year was such a screwed up year. The uh, teams that won their divisions will have bragging rights, and they didn't get a plaque. All right, so uh, uh, based on 2019 standings, if you look at the final standings there, you can pretty well figure what division you're going to kind of go in. The crew will move up if we get to eight in the red division. And uh, any new teams like uh, uh, Bolt on in, they for sure have one team. They got a brand new team, and we don't know what's going to happen with uh, Riverside. But uh, so they're in with one new team. Uh, well, my nearest count, I think we're at 19 right now. Oh, it isn't John John. Hey. Paul, well, did you get one of these? No. Right. Everybody got a copy of the rules and the final standings? Thank you. I'm going to take those two. So, uh, 
going 20 weeks, our opening day will be April 22nd. That'll finish us the Thursday before Labor Day. It'll be the last week. Uh, every Thursday night, 7.30 start. Uh, three division play. That's the end of page one. The way team enters their lineup first, as usual. Play directly across the uh, opponent as per the schedule. We've done that for several years now. 12 games with 21 points. We're entered depending upon what we do with the handicap. We'll talk about that. Interdivision play. It's always been heads up, but we'll just kind of figure on, or on a heads up, based uh, on actual handicap even last year. But depending upon what handicap we use, that may or may not change. Uh, if there's a tie for first place in any division, there will be a playoff night, not a playoff game. And it'll be the first one to win seven points. If you go through 12 matches and you end up 6-6, and each team captain will pick two players to represent the final game, the 13th game, to determine a champion. The loser will automatically take second place. If there's a tie for second place, we have a first, definite first place winner and a tie for second. We're only handing out two trophies or two plaques. Uh, the team with the most YTD points will be the winner. That's the only place it comes into effect and moving up and down divisions and team members. Any questions so far? This is not a union meeting. You guys are supposed to be throwing things at you, shit. You know? <laughs> <laughs> we don't have to wait for it. Yeah, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> yeah, wait, wait. <laughs> Unions are just yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Uh, in the event of bad weather, both Not teams control. must still show up. You must still show up and determine a waiting period of half an hour, make a decision what you're going to do. Usually both team captains agree, we'll meet again Tuesday night or whatever. Uh, or maybe you want to play, yep, hang out around some more. After half an hour, the team captain can make the call. If you haven't agreed with anything, team cap the home team captain will make the call. The player postpone it. Call on your scores, guys. I, I can't believe last year. I know it was a foobar year, but every week somebody forgot to call in the score. Every friggin' week. You know how many years we've been doing this? Okay, so just when they when the final match gets done and you mark down the final score, hey Shafe, here's the final. You can even text me. You you can put you know. River Rats 206 10, and Moby Dick's crew 202. Just, you can do it that simple too. You don't have to call. Uh, just be sure to call on the scores, guys. I hate looking at the at 11 o'clock at night and seeing somebody hasn't called in. Because if I get them by 10 o'clock, they'll be up before midnight, I promise you. They were last year. The results. All right, dues will be $125 per team, <laughs> plus $50 per team sponsor fee. Uh, Mike is not here, but we have a record of everybody who paid dues last year and did not take them back. Nobody took them back, as a matter of fact. So you have that credit coming, I will notify each one of you what your exact amount is due for this year. All right, so that credit is on the books for you already. Pardon me? Double you can if you guys. Oh, here's a, here we go. If you want, if you want to continue with 125 full, all that's going to do is give us much more prize money at the end of the year. So, what do you want to do, guys? You want to still make it 125? The only thing bad about that is some guys paid 60, some guys paid the whole year. How do you come up with a number? That would keep, be fair. Keep it at 125. Yeah. And that's what you're doing. Yeah. All right, so we're just going to keep it at 125. All right? You get a credit for whatever you paid last year. <coughs> Any questions? Any brand horseshoes can be used as long as it's not the G type? We, no, we polished it. 
We can. sanctioned shoe. Uh, the, uh, they sanctioned them? Rainbow Re singles are a sanctioned shoe and they're allowed. Oh, all right. Cool. <laughs> then we will get rid of them. <laughs> I don't know if we want to use them for hooking. Nobody, nobody uses them. It's just yeah. a silly, silly rule that was on the books where you can well, the rule actually says any brand horseshoes can be used as long as they are sanctioned by the NHPA. We're good. All right, player 65 and older, Cardi. <laughs> well, now I don't believe it. Next month. Players under the age of 18 and all women are allowed to throw from any distance but cannot step beyond the foul line in 27 feet. It's going to take a close person on this year. It's Harry, you know, I'm transgender now. <laughs> 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 Only on Thursday nights you feel like a woman, right? You do it every day at 70 switch. I can put it. That was a problem. You know, I was kind of seeing that last year for you. Hey, I'm not lying. Nice. I've been open. Oh, my God. A house can sponsor two teams for every two courts you have. Danny Bolton built uh, four pits. So he's allowed four teams there. He never gets that strong. Uh, we have, of course, six pits here, so we can have six teams. Riverside's a question mark. Where else are there multiple courts? They don't have on here uh, the Moose Knuckleheads Club. Oh, they don't have that? Yeah, Moose Knuckleheads. I didn't, on this one? Yeah, it's Ed's team. Are they coming back? Uh, yes. Yeah, you know why they're not on here? They weren't here in 2019, were they? No, they're, no, no, they're, they're coming. Playing. They didn't play. Yeah. They're, 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 they're coming back. back. Yeah, they're here in 2019. What's that? Yeah, they're here. They played in 2019. Okay. They didn't play in 2020. 2020. 2020. That's what I'm talking about. We didn't play in 2020. Yeah. Yeah. We didn't vote it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's bad. We're not going to play this for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All, right. all right, let's get down to the meat and the gravy then. Let's talk about the handicap, which way we want to go, points to be earned, etc., etc. First, let's review the rules, please. Uh, for the 2018 season, I got written down here. The league will, starting with rule number one, let's just read along. The gentleman to this rules will duly propose and pass at a quorum of the board of directors of Northern Illinois League at a special BOD board meeting on April 16th. The article this addendum supersedes the 2018 rules as passed in 2018. We should have changed out to 2019, probably. All rules or statements that refer to two division play are rescinded. We are three division. For the 2018 NHL season, the league will play with 19 teams. We divide them into three divisions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Division consists of seven or whatever. Whatever they consist of, guys. I'm going to try to get to 24. That's my goal. Well, before we go any further, I, I asked uh, two teams that are not here. Who's that young man that walked in? Gentlemen? Uh, if you will allow me to take $100 out of our money to advertise locally to try and get players and teams, I need to, you guys are the board of directors, I need your approval to do that. If you don't want me to spend it, then we'll find other means. So, can I get someone to motion it, or do you want to just not do it? Well, you know what, Terry, I mentioned that to Mike last year, they have all these websites that are. Uh, they have done. They have done diddly. I've been on all those websites. I've posted on those websites. We haven't got I've one never player. Seen one thing posted on that. You know, you're from McHenry or. Anything. I post on what? Huh? Posted on what? I think he's talking about. Right. You know, you're from McHenry. I never Facebook. heard of the place. Never heard of it. All right. That's there's nice. just there's a million places. Well, I know that. But so you far, know, you want I, to get local places because you want to keep local. Well, right? I understand that. So, so, you know all the websites are out there. You might be better right. off going on Facebook. But I can, I can get on the free stuff, right? I'm saying the local newspaper, something like that. Maybe I can get all of the local 
radio station should be just a free shot. I don't know. Who reads the newspaper? What's that? Who reads the newspaper? I do. I do. I've been here about once a year. Mark was here in the local paper. And they've got a pretty thing. About 14, 16 years. But it's still a pretty circular. Are you on Facebook, Terry? I am not. I go on Facebook about twice a year, maybe three times. So if I like, set up something for a fan page on Facebook, I wouldn't know if you had anybody respond to it, to be honest with you. But if well, somebody wants to does. take that ball by the uh, take by the horn and go with it, you're welcome to it. I want to try to fill the league back up. A couple teams are at three players, one team is at two players. <coughs> and uh, I'd like to, man, yeah, my goal is to get the 24 teams again. Those were the haters, those were the funders. And, and so, if you want to give me a bunch of time, if you don't, that's fine too. I'll go work at it regardless. <coughs> All right, there'll be no motion that's not even going to be brought up. All right, let's continue. Uh, rule 3, Division of Zone Team, 16, so I blue. All right. Team A will be a buy. That's all buy stuff. Team will be worth six points playing the battle game. Okay, because of the odd number in the red division, the seventh place under the card. We have an odd number division. Comes position height, the seventh place team is out. Unless there's another odd division number, like two sevens and an eight. So I don't know how that would work out, but then the two seventh place team can play each other. Any questions? All right, let's talk about the handicap. Uh, starting with what's in red. The addendum to 2019 rules is an explanation of the amendment to rules 8 and 9 of these NIHL rules. They're duly passed at the 2019 spring meeting of the team cabinets. In 2019, the NIHL will adopt a National Hockey League format of determining standings within all divisions for all interdivision play. A. During all intervision play, each night a team can earn 0, 1, or 2 NHL points based upon how many games are won that night. B. For interdivision play, standings will be based upon YTD and NHL points won, not year to date games won. And then C is win 0 to 4 games, 0 points, 5 to 7 games, 1 point, 8 plus games, 2 points. Now, if we decide to go with the NIHL system again, I have a recommendation for that point spread. First question on, on at hand is, do you want to go with what we ended up in 2019, or do you want to go back to the old days of just playing 12 points and uh, counting your YTD wins? Discussion is over. Volunteers, anybody? I like old days. You like the old days? I, 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 I like the old days. Kind of 2019 start with it. Uh, <coughs> only thing, I thought everything was working fine for the first two thirds of the season where the teams were kind of grouped fairly close together. I would have liked to see it brought all the way through the whole season and see how it looks at the end of the year. Would I go up? I'd like to see it be done all the way through the season, not stop at the last day and see what effect it has, and if it doesn't work, then we always get the point. But I, a couple of things I'd like to say about that system of 2019 is that there are those crazy things that happen when you put yourself out there and you're there every week for that 20 weeks, and then you run into situations, and I'm sure we can all say that. Well, we, get, we run into a, a, a tough player that hasn't been there all year. And now, you, now we're sitting there uh, watching handicap get skewed in those last couple of many tough weeks. And then we are only a few points away from that team that's in front of you. That hasn't, that hasn't worked out well, uh, I think, in terms of uh, being fair. <coughs> Not doing any disjustice to you, 
but your subjectivity as the schedule is made. The 2019 system kind of softens everything in terms of things that the way you look at things, it kind of blends them a little bit. And having someone there not all the time, uh, let's just say, you know, some kind of uh, family emergency, you can't feel the best you. The, the 2019 rules kind of give you that break once in a while. So those are some things I'd like to throw out just to think about rather than this hardcore golf boys, golf boys, golf boys. If you want to go down the team, if you can't harvest the same team, unfortunately that's on you. And I have the same problem. Half the time trying to find a team is your problem. Now, you can't hold a team accountable whether they play one week, three weeks, as long as that player is not playing for anybody else, it's not a big deal. Right. He's still on your, he's still on your rock. So you can't. The handicaps on weeks, not players. So you can't say one player be the whole team. I'll say there's a couple. You, you can't do that. I'll say there's a couple players in the league that are going to keep it. Exactly, but that's the team. You, you can't. And what you're missing the point is that. That person is your, your team is sitting there coming in week after week. This is the key player in your team. So you're mad because this one player might no, play I'm against you, but not, not play against somebody else. I'm not saying that at all. I'm just saying. Does this team. player play with anybody else? Any other I'm team? not even in the discussion. That comes up for the roster. I'm, I'm talking about. That's per team. I'm just talking about walking in, giving somebody 11, uh, per se, in that particular night when you have two nights to, to go in the season. And that person hasn't been there all year, and that can skew. That I understand. And, that, and that's, that was my point. Not to but that's years. when there is a limit. I mean, we got a limit. Six people on. Yeah, now, yeah, if, if this team, up, see this team already had that. six people, they yeah, brought in that person spot, so they can't do that. There should be a, there's there's a six person. Well, we, don't, we don't have an official roster rule. Uh, uh, six. We only have six. Show up at a night. That you do not get show up to play. I thought you had. I thought we did have six people. No, you could have ten people. Well, you now we have six. Then maybe you should have maybe limit that to six. Yeah, well, you can't bring in an extra person when the. I'm not talking, and, and, and I appreciate what you're saying. What I was saying is a key player that has always been on the team. All of a sudden, they got a broken leg. But what they meant, and they're there now. They're ready to go. They're ready to play. But they haven't been there for the first 18 weeks. And that, team, and that team suffered. <coughs> and they're all sitting in last place in the division. And with that other person, they're all competitive. There was a, we did have a sheet that showed your six player roster at you one point? time. We have a but that way, if you fill out that sheet at the beginning of the year, I got her that's right. But then again, what do you do? Well, if I was going to come in, what difference is it? See, the monster said the exact opposite of what you're playing. He played all year, and then when he came to the whole position night, he couldn't play. Right. So he was the exact, exact opposite. Where instead of bringing somebody in, they had, their, they had their best person sit out. Best person? Did you say that? Did you think of a character? Jesus, you brought us a match. It's hard to, the guys are going to talk about the floor. So, I got to edit that. So you see, Curry <laughs> came up on one side of the argument. He's coming over and going, I said something. And I think the 2019 kind of blends that a little bit so it's not our fact versus the old 12 points. That's all I'm saying. You can win it or you can't. Ken, you got four. Uh, Jim is a captain of our team, but I talked to him today. He asked me to come because he didn't know if John or anybody who would show up for me. Okay, and I didn't play that much, but he said if this comes up at the meeting that he thought that everybody in our team they were they all were foregoing back to the old way of the club. So that's the honest thing. All right, so I, I, my personal opinion is the way it works. I like the NHL because you seem to be in it for most of the season. The only problem with the current the way our turn Wins are on our NIHL is uh, you can only win two points. You're three points out of home position, I shoot at. That's the way it goes. 
and if we were to go to NIHL, but as I propose, with a different scoring system, so you could win up to four points per night instead of just two. And off the top of my head, I think it was zero to three was zero points. Four, five, and six were one. Seven, eight was two. Nine, ten was three. And we got to eleven. No. Seven, eight was not the right amount. It's, it's on the Seven, video. Seven, eight, huh? It's on the video on my site from last year. We, we discussed this whole thing on 2020 before we actually knew where we were playing. We discussed it, got all the points, everything was set, and it's on the video. So you need to, I think it was up to five points, because zero was zero points. One, two, three. One, two, three, four was four, uh, one point. And then it went on from there. Yeah, but the, only way you could get, the only way you could get the maximum was to take all 12. You had to get 11, you didn't get the maximum. If you got all 12, you got the maximum. Four or five, or whatever. And we talked about doing that to keep people motivated yeah. to actually win all 12. Or, you know, once you got to the eight, well, that's better. That's, I was going to bring up what you guys were doing there. You know, that's what that we always had a problem with not getting any points winning four games. You know, yeah. Suck for us. Especially if you knew, right? Yeah. That's so we put all this effort in to try to play and actually come out and do this, and then we get shit on it. You know, we know. So, like, well, I'll bring up a point. New teams. Okay, say you just start and you go off of this. You say you did your best to win these games, you come out with zero. How does that make you feel? Yeah, you know, new teams. You have to satisfy with it. Have to do it many times, or yeah. But so, wouldn't you rather see three and add up that way than zero, zero, especially, zero? Especially if you can't, if you can't get a point. point they want, or win they want to see points. Yeah, it's very right. surging. And it makes so you, feel, you know, get those four games against some of the, right. you know, better players. Oh, exactly. Yeah. 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 Well, well, we'd rather see three a week, week than zero a week. Oh, he's looking at you, then? Yeah. Well, no, because you're going to one of the new oh. teams. So, it's like, <laughs> so when you're in a low division, I think you'd rather see some wins than no It was just the point where we were, you know, trying to four, zero through four had nothing. Right, right. We win four games. We win four games consistently. We still get yeah, but you knew you won those. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. And the other team did too, but didn't fucking matter. <laughs> Only if we kept the score. Okay. Who drank more? Depends. Okay. Depends what team we were playing. Oh, we had more fun. Right? Yeah. Well, we definitely had more fun. But <laughs> until we wrote the score, then we're like, we <laughs> <laughs> Then they were just drinking their sorrows. It wasn't for fun. <laughs> Well, I just kind of quickly jotted down something, and, and uh, like the sand snipers will think about this. Uh, if you don't win a game, you get zero. If you win only one game, you get zero. Two and three wins, you get one point. Four and five, you get two points. Six, seven, eight, you get three. Nine is your goal, because nine, 10, 11, you get four. And if you win all 12, you get five points. That handles the trying to win four games to get a point. Five. Uh, you'd have five to, games. You'd have to win two. To so get a it's point. five games you, to get one point. Uh, five games will give you two points. That's the system. I know, just said. He said, I just want to. He said, four. If you go up there and I shut Now, that also means, at the end of, okay, time, one second. At the, end of the, at the end of the year, when we come to position night, any team within five points has got a shot. Maybe slim and none, or maybe too many teams in between, they got to pass up, but they got a shot. The numbers fall right. You know, if uh, Dave's team loses two and Perry teams wins one and my team ends up with six, you wind up taking all 12, you can win by one. Yep. You got a shot. That's a shot. Yeah. Right. All right. Not good. Let's go easier. Not good. 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 Number C, zero to four wins, you get one point. Five to seven wins, you get two points. Uh, eight to nine, you get three. Ten or more, you get four. Zero to zero to zero to four, you get one point. Five to seven, you get two points. 
Now, if we end up with odd numbers, and, uh, it's difficult to end up the final eight weeks all intra-division. It's difficult as hell. Uh, one year we just let the schedule determine who you're going to play for the final weeks. But I can probably work out with my stuff. I'm saying if I can't, I'll let you guys know I can't do it. I look at all possibilities. We're doing this. Are all the teams that didn't play last year coming back? All the teams that played last year at this point are coming back. All the teams that didn't play? Not all of them, not that I'm aware of, no. Ironman is a question. Uh, but yes, the other ones seem to indicate they're coming back. What we had up last year? I'm sorry? 13 teams last year? Yeah. Or we go back to just the plain 6-12 spot and the 12-point handicap for the whole season. I second I didn't first it. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're doing. You're not doing it because of the game, because it's easier to figure out you're a team captain now. I know you're a Just that. Moving on to AHL gives you a better chance at the end. <laughs> well, I would have to put the numbers together, and I did a couple of years. I do it for. I can't remember what I worked. I think it was, I think it was the NHL season I worked at. I think I kind of just worked out that it would have wound up about the same. I thought, because I know a lot. You had all the people up there. Yeah. Right? I can't remember. The whole friggin' year went by where I braided it. Uh, you know, it was nuts. So, uh, we figured we'd be sitting here already. Well, it, we, you know, one way or the other, guys, I honestly am up for either one. I like the NHL. I really do like it. Uh, or NHL. I like our old system also. My guys simply want to play. They could care less about how we score. They like to win, but they run up to That's their attitude. So what do you want to do? What does is, what is the majority say here? Team captain, guys. Team captain. You got two votes. I say go back to the 12 point, the regular one. I say go back to 12. I say go back to 12. Let's do, right. let's do this. Let's do it. Well, uh, we're going to have. I don't think we played that list again. Oh. Now, whoever didn't play last year, your, your oh. chance will come to vote right here. I'm just going to do, rather than just to try to do an I and A, I'll just call off your team. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten teams here tonight. And you want an NHL or NIHL? We're going to say NHL or 12 points. We're going to say old versus new. Oh, there you go. There you go. Old versus new. How about black versus white over uh, Old know. versus new. All right. Old will be the, the, by the 12 point system. New will be the NHL. Now call your team out. Just say old or new. All right. Say one more thing. New. The new is the NHL. I make, I make a motion if we go new with a modification to the points. Not what we had back in. Not what we had back in 2019, but the discussion we just had about increasing the points per bracket. Yeah, that so, so thing. people realize we're not working with the roll numbers. Well, we'll see it, was it, it. it was a start. It was a start. New and modified. Oh, new, new and a modified <laughs> point. Right. Well, we're going to. We'll, I think we're on agree that we can modify the points with System One, but the system is the same. It's not. It's either the old system or it's a new system. Either way. As I recall, white or red division gave 12 to the blue and gave 6 to the white for the actual handicap. But that's side. handicap. That's something different than we're talking about now. That's that's well because we're talking now. We're talking wins points. and losses. Yeah. Right now we're going points, points, points and not the handicap. Yeah. Yeah. It's just right. No, I don't think it was different because it was 612. It was 612. I, I think it was constant 612, and the white gave the constant. Gave six. That was what it was, constant. And, and the reason being is when you start out, you, you know, potentially, even if you want to, whatever system we go to, say a four point system for the NHL. Well, when, when you go, go that points, way, you got to remember that it's hard to figure out the handicap because now it's going to be lower because the points are lower. That's the point. Yeah, that's the point. 
That's the point behind the 612. It'll take you 10 weeks before you get up to 18 points. Well, that's why you play the first place team who had the red division who's got 26. See, that's handicap. Now all of a sudden we voted the old. Now we've got to go back and talk to handicap. How do you want to do it? Yeah, well, let's, let's, let's do it one step at a time. All right, first we determine which way you want to go. Old system, we got this now. The, the back in 12 points, 12 games. New system is the NHL that we did in 2019. Modified, we're going to modify. River Rats. Old. Old. Old shoes are here. Marty Monsters. Old. Blood shooters. We have a new cat. No. Yeah. <laughs> Repeaters. Old. Stingers. Old. Ringers. Old. Clanksfield. Old.
Do you want to just leave it at 65 guys? Do you want to go to 66? What do you like? 66 this year. I like it. I like it. I like it. Fuck that. I like it. 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 I
here on March 28th. You guys said Chili Open.